Napoleon attacked and annexed German states to his own. After his defeat, the Congress of Vienna, which took place in Italy, made the German Confederation. It was a weak alliance. Prussia's king turned down the crown of from the people. It was from the people, so he didn't really care. Bismarck finally united Germany. He used war to conquer German states and annex them. We did France, Austria, and Denmark. Germany's industrial bone was doing part of ample iron, coal, and the other ingredients for industrial development. In the 1830s, nationalist leader Giuseppe Manzini founded Italy. Their goal was to be united, strong, and independent. There was then the French overthrow. The United Common Language and History of Italy. The nationalists spread their words. It reminded Italians of the beauty of ancient Rome and the medieval papacy. Camillo Cavour was the Prime Minister of 1859. He war with Austria. He had secret negotiations with Napoleon III. He protected Sardinia. Victor Emmanuel turned over Napoli and Sicily. Victor Emmanuel was crowned king. In the 1870s, Italians conquered Rome. In 1861, Italians voted and approved. It was multinational. Frank Deep became a leader. And he compromised a political power. Francis Joseph was an 18-year-old ruler who wanted to inherit the throne. He wanted to please people and split up Austria-Hungary.